as of the making of this video, it is my 27th birthday. And I just got a really cool gift from my brother and my sister. This is Elite Series 28, first time in the line, Demolition Crush. The other member of Demolition, other than Axe and Smash. So let's take a closer look at the packaging. I was doing the crush thing before Rusev. There is in the packaging, comes with entrance vest, mask, and gauntlets. Flashback. And on to the back of the flashback. We see Crush is ready to kick some ass. His little bio, you can pause and read. And there he is half naked in the ring. And as you can get in the line, and I have him, I have him, I have him, I have him, and him. Damn, I completed a set. Time for a round of applause. So let's call some demolition and get demolition crush out of the packaging. Like so. Boom, here's Crush out of the packaging. Ready to do some damage, wearing those gauntlets full of silver studs, that jacket full of studs, and he's got studs on his trunks, he got studs on this thing, I don't know what it's called, knee pads, studs on his boots, let's take a closer look at his face, and he looks fucking pissed as hell, Crush, why are you so pissed, it's a good day, today's my birthday, my 27th birthday, so let's be happy, would you be happy if I gave you your, your mask with all the little studs on it? Would that make you happy? Yeah. Okay, I'll put the mask back on you a little bit. I just gotta go over your face. So, here's his face. Besides the scowl on his face, we see that he's got three different paints on his face. He's got black over here, red over here, black over here, and silver over here. And as you can see, he's got a really nice looking mullet. He's one of the few people who can successfully pull off a mullet. Because I can't see this guy with a crew cut. So let's put the mask on him. Which fits fairly nice. Looks like he just came out of Hellraiser. You solved the puzzle box. But besides the mask, the jacket, and the gauntlets removal. So let's remove them. Now this is what he looks like when he's ready to fight. I think he's less scary with the gear on. If you've seen the Mattel release of Demolition from a few years ago, these little bits were colored in silver to match the studs. Mattel failed it in color them, and I'm tempted to do it myself. Here's one of the gauntlets. This thing right here actually could be removed if you either cut it or take his head off, but why would you? That would be a waste of time. And that's my review of Demolition Crush. Not a bad way to start off my birthday. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you soon. Demolition Crush.